Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Now, I know that it probably hasn't escaped anyone's attention that the world at the moment is going through a crisis. It's affecting me, it's affecting you. You can't look anywhere without reading about this crisis. You know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about, of course, the simp crisis that is happening right now. They are everywhere. And though they're not new, you know, they've been around for a long time, you know, They've been called incels, I call them the horny male virgins on this channel. They're, it's not a new thing. They've been around for a long time. Since the dawn of time, in fact. Um, but just recently, they have started to let their numbers be known. And it's, it's scary. It's very scary how many of them are there. And you, you can blame one person. I certainly blame one person. I blame... The OK Boomer Girl for this uprising. Whatever you say, boomer. Okay, okay, boomer, yeah, boomer. Whatever you say, boomer. Okay, okay, boomer, yeah, boomer. Whatever you say, boomer. Okay, okay, boomer. Now, as most of you that follow this channel will probably be aware of, I, the last two to three weeks, have made a couple of videos on the OK Boomer Girl and the whole situation. Uh, surrounding her basically she came out and said that she didn't have a problem with simping in fact she thought simping was king shit all right simping isn't bad simping is king shit okay you're a king if you're or if you're not afraid to simp <laughs> the reason she said this whole simping uh, is king shit was because when she first did her original TikTok, her OK Boomer TikTok, which made her blow up, obviously she got, about, I think, about 100,000 people, like, simps following her. And then she let slip on stream, or I don't know if she let it slip, she just said it, I don't think she was trying to hide it, um, that she had a boyfriend. And then this made the, the like, 100,000 simps unfollow her. Um, me, like, I recently got me and my boyfriend shirts, Bernie shirts. Oh, hell no! So, obviously, that's less money in her pocket, and she needs to get those simps back on board. So, she made this statement of, there's no wrong being a simp, simping is king shit. So, you've basically made it okay to simp. You've made these male horny virgins, these simps, think that what they're doing, you know, it, there's no wrong with it. It's not pathetic. You shouldn't make fun of these people. And now, you are reaping what you sow. <laughs> And that's what today's video is about, because by by saying that, you know, basically you approve this simp behavior, you have opened yourself up to a whole new level of simping that I personally, like, well, I won't say I haven't seen it before, but you basically have bought this on yourself, is what I'm saying. You have exposed yourself to the, what I, I would call the final boss in simping. And before I go any further, I just want to say that this is, you know, I'm only joking here, I don't mean any kind of, but this, this is some funny shit, you know, I'm not trying to be malicious or anything. So what I'm talking about is this guy on Twitter <laughs> a couple of days ago, so this is how it all started. This guy, one of her simps on Twitter, tweeted at her, hi. And then she replied, hi, back. Now, after jizzing in his pants, I imagine, you won't believe what this guy did next. I sound like Mr. Boss for the Wind, don't I? You won't believe what this guy did next. Of course, a girl you uh, stalk, shall we say, on, on Twitter, says hi back to you. What's the first thing you do? Of course, you make a short animated fucking cartoon thing on her. Yeah, because that's not fucking weird. And that's what this guy did, this ultimate simp. He made a cartoon for the OK Boomer Girl. And we're going to watch this cartoon here now. I'm not going to watch the whole thing. It's about a minute and a half long. Um, I'll link it below. You can go to his Twitter and see it for yourself in its full glory. But I just wanted to watch a couple of sections of it today and kind of go over it. And yeah, anyway, here we go. So we start off with the OK Boomer girl standing presumably on top of a mountain, 
presumably looking at the army of simps that she is building to slowly take over the world and, you know, one simp at a time. Um, I want to, before we go any further, just remind you that this cartoon was made because she said hi to him on Twitter. Imagine if she, like, fucking replied, like, hi, how are you? He probably would have made a full fucking hour and a half feature length film. Pixar quality. Probably would have held like casting for it and shit. Unbelievable. So he looks at his phone, she sees that she's replied to his hi tweet with hi, and then he screams to the stars, and a tear comes to his eye, and probably his penis as well, let's be honest, they didn't show that in the cartoon. I just, this level of simping is just fucking crazy. What was he expecting to get out of this? I mean, at the very least, personally, I think that he was probably expecting, you know, maybe a little rub and tug kind of, or maybe just a rub, you know, above the pants kind of thing, a little cock ride. I don't know what he was expecting from this. I don't fucking know, but he's put time into making a cartoon just simply by someone saying hi to him. He has got to have been expecting some shit from this. <laughs> Now he's running. He's running, and look at that face. Look at that face. That is the face of a rapist. I'm sorry, but it is. This video, if I could describe this video, there's so many words I could use to describe. Fucking creepy, disturbing, but top of the list for me, the number one word I would use to describe this video is rapey. It's very fucking rapey. <laughs> So next we see him, he's come to the end of his run and he's literally reaching out to grab the OK Boomer girl and then she kind of disappears, which I don't know if that's some sort of metaphorical thing for like the police have found him and they've took him away or whatever. And then it cuts to him pulling his rapey face again. And it pretty much ends there. Like I say, you can uh, watch the whole thing on his Twitter if you want. I just, the OK Boomer girl, what the fuck? Look what you've done to yourself. So... He obviously tweeted this at the OK Boomer Girl. If we look here. So he tweeted her and said, Are you proud of my creation? And she responded, Oh. My. God. Which I think is about right. That's probably what I would have responded. You know, I would have responded that and then called the police. Because, yeah. Um, so I thought maybe this guy's joking. You know, maybe this is a bit of a joke. And if so, it's fucking hilarious. I mean, I certainly laughed at this. But I, I looked down his uh, his Twitter and his replies and stuff, and he he's a simp, man. He's a simp for her. Look at this one here. Uh, the OK Boom Girl says, Sometimes I wonder if I'm enough, and I have to remember that I am, and I can do whatever I put my mind to. And he puts, You are enough. Nerd. You're a fucking nerd. Nerd. You're a fucking nerd. And then, then you go down and look at other things and it's just typical simp shit. There's loads of things where he literally just replies to her saying Queen and My Queen like he's Jon fucking Snow or some shit. Uh, so yeah, this isn't a joke. This is actually legit. And you know what? OK Boomer Girl, you bought this on yourself and this is a very slippery slope. You've got people today making cartoons about you and stuff. Like I say, someone's going to make... So you talk any more than this, just saying hi. If you said how are you, you're going to have some sort of fucking... Toy Story 5 version thing made for you. <laughs> it's just absolutely ridiculous. And it's only going to get fucking weird because this guy, you know, he's made a video where he's basically running at you and trying to grab you. Maybe he'll try and do some shit like that if he sees you in real life. Maybe he won't. I don't know. I'm not going to... I don't know the guy personally. But there'll be some level of simp out there, probably higher than this guy, that will try it. And one day, you are going to... If you keep going this way, you're going to be found, like, in your house with a bunch of, I don't know, My Little Ponies shoved up your butthole or some shit. 
<laughs> and you'll only have yourself to blame because you said it's okay to be a simp. Simping is king shit. Just so you could get a few more donations on Twitch. Well, you know, welcome to crazy town. <laughs> so, so uh, yeah, once again, guys, this video is a joke. You know, I've got no beef with this guy. I just thought this was pretty fucking funny to... And, and crazy. I'm not going to lie, it is crazy to uh, do this. But, dude, if you do end up watching this video, d this ain't it, bro. You, you're never going to... You're never going to see a vagina, ever. Apart from in, like, textbooks or some shit, if you keep doing stuff like this. No girl is, like, fucking going to be telling a story down the line at some party. Hey, how did you two guys meet? Oh, well, I said hi to him on Twitter, and then he made a fucking 1 minute 30 cartoon of him chasing after me and trying to grab me. Oh, yeah, classic. Classic love story. It's not going to happen, mate. Just, uh, just, you know, sorry to burst your bubble. Anyway, guys, uh, <laughs> that's about it for today's video. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers, guys.